But I need more for them. We can supply you with a few more blankets, but not many. Can I take a look inside the monastery? What's got into you, boy? The grounds inside the monastery belong to the monks of the Order of Saint Benedict. No others shall pass. I've been sent here from Talmberg. I'm to speak with the one responsible for construction. That'll be the master builder. Or with our brother, the overseer. What matter is it you're here about? It has to do with the stone for construction. Ah, then that's a matter of supply. You'll want to talk to the overseer. He knows more about that sort of thing. His study is right above us, more or less. Go up the steps to the left and then head back in this direction, almost the whole way. Farewell. God be with you. I've come in the name of Sir Divish. And why is Sir Divish interested in that regrettable accident? He'd I guess it played a crucial role. But I don't intend to stand in the way of your investigation. I've already... Thank you. I appreciate it. Who's in charge of perch... Mainly it's me. I pay the fees and make arrangements for delivery. But those in charge of the actual building take care of the rest. I'm not knowledgeable when it comes to the quality... Of they take care of storage as well. Yes. But usually, whatever arrives is used up straight away. Do you remember when they brought the last delivery of stone? Yes. It rained a lot that week, so they let the carriage sit right outside of the gate on the other side of the wall. It took some time before it was dry enough. And there wasn't anything strange about it? A little strange, I suppose. Usually, they bring us a large block of stone, which the builders cut to size. But this time, it was a number of smaller pieces. No one complained. They probably saw it as less work. I heard that you were late with your payment to the town. That's true. We ourselves had late payments, and it took some time before we gathered enough money. Take care now.
Mind out. My respects to you. The Overseer sent me. You're to show me the place where the accident happened. <sighs> like I've got time to spare to show you round. He should have done it himself. Because of the Talmberg stone. I'd be interested in what kind. <laughs> but I... And have you noticed anything else going on? Of course. It's a construction site. Things are all... <laughs> So it's just like any... Essentially, yes. Occasionally someone brings in bad wood or a man cuts off his thumb and... I'd be interested to know what the men... Who's been stealing, which men from the monastery go to... And then there's that devil... Who's stealing? Could some... According to the rumors, everyone from the abbot and the custodian down to the lowest laborer. And something gets lost here and there, that's true. You talked about the devil's... I did. They say it was found in the hole dug for the foundation of the scaffolding. They moved it so it would do its harm. And who might know more? Shouldn't you be investigating the stone? Leshek's in charge of the scaffolding, so ask him if you... Where's the scene of the accident? It didn't happen on the main site. It was at the outbuilding next to the church, right under the long stairs before the entrance door. Ask my assistant who's in charge there. You'll easily wreck. God be with you. Can you tell me something about the poor wretch with the. Yarek? He. was. A decent person. Did he have any enemies? Somebody who would want to... Kill him? You think someone threw that stone block on his head? Who's in charge of the place where the accident happened? Me. I watch over everything here, and when necessary, I go to see... And are you responsible for checking the stone? <sighs> yes. We tested what load they could handle and how much they crumbled during dressing. But... So... Where were you when it happened? I'm not even sure. Somewhere else. I ran over when I heard the screaming. Did you notice anything suspicious? No, I didn't. These things happen with great...
What else do you, sir? I heard you found something. It's true. I dug it up during work. I then ran away with it and got rid of it so the others wouldn't see. And what was it that nobody... What do you think? Here. On holy... But it was outside the monastery walls. Where exactly? Is there anything else there worth seeing? Nothing but scaffolding. We started to dig... And are you sure it was a devil's... I know what I saw. I can recognise the humans besides. That thing... And where is it now? What did you do with it? I... I was taking it down to the river to throw it in. Only I dropped... Hmm. I'll see... Take care now. stone fell on him here. You can still see the marks. This has to be the stone that hit him. I'll take a piece of it. Maybe someone will recognize it. looks genuine, but I'm not capable of judging. I hope I can be of help to you. Whose house is this? It's our local custodians. <laughs> the most esteemed, sir. Sir. You don't seem to think very much of him. Well, of course I do. No man with a nose so stuck up that it acts as. What does the custodian do anyway? Well, he's meant to look. But. Well, in fact, he seems more interested in. I'm much obliged. Don't make you look bored. Beyond tears. How can you be bored here in Sasau? It's such a... Don't even talk to me about it. They won't let you touch the books. They don't want to talk to you. Me! Like some kind of thief! Well, they say there's not much left of... What's that got to do? I'm not blaming you. It's just that only monks have... Folk were even taking relics away from Semprocopia's cave for protection before. 
No, no. I know. But I'd never dream of doing that. Maybe I could help. How? No, not at all. I was going to bring you something. You could touch it for luck and then I'd return it. Of course. Then I'd be very grateful. I've got a bowl for you from the cave. A bowl? Behold. Ah. Is it really? Yes. From his cave. A trip. You're right. My I'm in your debt, Henry. Thanks, but I don't want anything. Truly? My pleasure. And Henry? Yes? I just wanted to touch it for- If you took something you shouldn't have, I- Good luck then. Yeah. 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 I'm honored that a knight such as you. The Lady of Talmberg, sir. Uh, through no fault of ours, I can tell you. We had a large stone ordered for mounting on the crown, a beautiful Moldova. In short, the good merchant, Martin Wieser, it's like the ground swallowed. Lady Stephanie won't be. Uh, look, we've got something else here we can replace the stone with, but, and definitely not worthy of our fine crown. Oh, if I only had someone who'd try to find. Why don't you just ask me? Of course I'll... Well, that fellow, as you called him, the esteemed merchant, Martin Wieseck, was last... Evidently, he never made it. Ooh. Well, I'll look for him, but he could be far over the mountains by now. Or under the... Take care now. Yeah. 
garlic soup for the winter, onion soup for the spring, asparagus for taste, and prunes for what ails you. Try them! Yeah! Mother of God! Good day to you. Be with you. I found this skull. People are saying it's the skull of a demon. It certainly looks like it. Well, let's see. Those are deer antlers that someone's... I'm glad to hear it's not the real thing. Someone must have put it there. And they put a lot of work into it, too. The horns are held on tight, even though it was lying in water. Ugh. 